Sandrine Chatron and I play the harp. I started playing harp when I was eight years old. I saw play, someone playing a harp on a concert. Uh, some uh, students of the music school where my brother was uh, already studying the violin. And uh, I think I liked the um, gesture. You know, the gesture, the movement of the harp, because it's really, uh, everything is round in the harp, and also the movement you do, it's quite beautiful. And also, maybe I think I like the sound. I don't really remember, but I was really uh, sure that I wanted to start with the harp. This is a pedal harp, concert pedal harp, we say, and uh, it's the harp we play in the orchestra. It's a string instrument, a pluck string instrument. You play with your fingers. And you use only four fingers on each hand, instead of five, because you need some strength. And uh, you, so you pull the strings in the middle, and you let them ring. And the strings are, the vibration of the strings goes to the soundboard, soundboard, and to the body of the harp, caisse de résonance, and all the instrument is, uh, vib has a vibration. In an orchestra, it, uh, most of the time it gives a color. It's not uh, hurt, it's not uh, meant to be hurt all the time, but it's more, uh, yes, really colorful, and, uh, and uh, sometimes it sustains the harmony, or sometimes it's an effect like a glissando. It's very typical of the harp. When I play harp, uh, it's very sensual because I, uh, I take the harp like that on my shoulder and I hold it with my knees and then I embrace it with my arms like if you want to cuddle some, someone but it's the harp. And when you play, you really feel the vibrations. All the instruments, is, uh, there is a vibration everywhere, so you feel it also. It's a very intimate relationship with my instrument. It's a big, big instrument. And, uh, but it, once you have it in your arms, it becomes uh, very personal. 